Cardano, Cardano, Cardano. Everyone loves Cardano. Well, not everybody. But out of all the top, out of all the altcoins out of the top 20, I think Cardano is a very good pick for the next bull run 2023-2024. My story on Cardano. Got into Cardano in like 2018, 2017. I don't remember, but I know I paid over a dollar for it. And before I knew it, within a year, Cardano had dropped down to two cents during the COVID dump. Um, I was very depressed, but I bought a bunch more at five cents, eight cents, uh, 10 cents. And it all worked out for me in 2021 when I was able to unload most of my Cardano at about a buck 75. Yes, I should have held till $3, but I really thought the top was near and I didn't want to take any chances. So I sold most of mine at $1.75 and thank God I did because now Cardano is down at 80 cents. What's my plan? I want to rinse and repeat. Ah, the old rinse and repeat. What does that mean? I want to do exactly what I did in 2017, 2018, but I want to do it bigger and badder. What does that mean? Well, instead of only putting a few, a few thousand dollars in like I did in 2017, I'm going to put a lot more than, more than that in, especially if Cardano dumps under 50 cents. I'm hoping for the biggest dump ever with Cardano. Like I said, I have a bunch in it right now because I've been cost averaging under a dollar. But I want to see Cardano at like 50 cents, 40 cents, 30 cents. I think anything under 50 cents, really, I would really feel comfortable uh, deploying a lot of money I have on the side in Cardano. I think next bull run Cardano will probably hit between $5 and $10. So if I can get it for about 50 cents, 60 cents, that's not too bad. Um, especially if I kind of go, you know, not all in, but I really go in heavy. Um, you know, the one thing you have to be careful about these altcoins is you don't know what's going to be popular uh, next bull run. I made that mistake with Litecoin. Litecoin was very popular in 2017, and nobody gave a crap about it in 2019. I don't think that's going to be the case with Cardano. I think Cardano has one more bull run left in it. There's a lot of stuff going on with Cardano. Uh, there's an update, I believe, in June with Cardano. Um, which, going, which is going to uh, increase uh, the transaction speed. Um, and a lot of dApps are waiting to go online in June. So there's a lot of good news coming for Cardano. There's a lot of people working on it. Charles Hoskinson, who is the CEO, and I believe he's the, the creator and founder, has pretty much lived up to most of what he said he was going to do. Um, he's usually a little bit late, but that's fine. But for the most part, you can tell he's dedicated to Cardano. And a good thing about Cardano, there's not too much hype behind it. The people running the show, Charles Hoskinson and everybody else, they're not hype artists. It's not like buying some sort of hype coin where like, you know, even like Solana or even, I know, pick, pick a coin where, you, where it's just basically hype, 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 false promises, pumpers, shills. You don't see that as much with Cardano. And that's why I think when Cardano takes off, it's really going to take off. Um, when Cardano hit $3, I knew that was pretty much the top. I thought the top was actually going to be at about $2. It hit $3. I was thinking there's no way it can go any higher than $3. Bitcoin was at like $68,000 and it did dump. And now we're back down to 80 cents. Um, I know a lot of people who never sold any of their Cardano and they bought it like 20, 30, 40 cents. I know a guy who bought it a dollar and he didn't sell. And, they're, and a lot of these people are just going to end up holding their Cardano right down back to 30 and 40 cents. That's why you got to take profits, folks. So, like I said, Cardano, good project. Um, a, lot of, uh, a, lot, a lot of money behind this project. There's a lot of whales accumulating Cardano. So I think the longer it basically is in the accumulation phase which will probably be for the next few months, maybe the next year, it's going to really pump hard next bull market. And there's not too much FUD behind Cardano. The only thing I could really even find is this stupid thing that Charles Hoskinson said he like went to college or and it turns out he only has an associate's degree and he said he was a PhD dropout and then people were saying, well, that implies he is a PhD dropout, so that implies he has a four-year degree and it turns out he only has an associate's degree and he took classes. Who cares? Almost everybody kind of embellish, embellishes their, um, their college. And reading into this, it doesn't even sound like he even did embellish it. The guy says he's a dropout. I mean, who cares? 
So that's really all I could find. There's really not too much FUD behind it. And that's what I like. I don't like a lot of these like hype artists like Justin Sun with Tron, where every two days there's some sort of weird story coming out, um, talking about how he lied about something or he scammed somebody. Uh, that's not what you want. And Cardano is not that type of project. So, <clears throat> you know, Cardano right now hovering at uh, about 80 cents. So not too bad. It had a high of about $3. Uh, and now it's all the way back down to 80 cents. That's about a 60, 70% drop. That is a great time to start accumulating Cardano. Just be aware, if you buy now, it could easily drop down to 20 cents. You have to have money on the side. If you got $5,000 to invest in Cardano, you put $3,000 in right now, and you save that last $2,000 for a giant dump. Um, and that's really what you have to do with all of these cryptos. We could be at the bottom right now, I personally don't think so, but you have to always have skin in the game just in case we're at the bottom. I think we got a, a, about another 30% more, 40% more drop in Cardano. Before it hits the bottom, it might stay down there for a year. It might just happen in a flash crash, but I think we need more of a flushing out of the system. And I'm not just talking about Cardano. I think if Bitcoin drops down to the 20s, that's when you're gonna see Cardano and all these other coins drop heavy. Bitcoin at about $25,000, you'll see Cardano at about 60 cents, 50 cents. That would be an awesome time to buy. If you can get Cardano at 40 cents, that's even better. Because if Cardano goes up to $10 in the next bull run, seven to $10 or more, you're gonna do really, really well. So right now you have to be planning for the next bull run. Right now crypto is boring, it's depressing. We got war, we're in a bear market. There's really not much to say. All you can do is wake up every day and just kind of hope there's a dump and just buy. And basically just think the future. Think what you're going to be doing in two years in the next bull market. You know, I've already lived through one bull market. I did pretty good, but I could have done a lot better. And I'm not going to make the same mistakes I made the last bull market. I'm going to take more profits and I'm going to put more money in in the bear market. Because I was just kind of playing around the last bull market. I was kind of playing around with crypto. I wasn't sure what I was going to do. I wasn't sure. I didn't believe in it. But now I'm a believer seeing, you know, I was able to pay off a rental property, buy a car, basically with my Cardano. So I'm going to do that all over again, but I'm going to do it bigger and badder this time. And hopefully I can just retire. So I'm hoping for that 40 cent uh, Cardano dump, four, 30 cent, even at 50 cents, I'll probably go in pretty heavy. But um, yeah, that's it. So good project. Just, um, just, you know, buy those dips and hopefully you can get it for, you know, under 50 cents. There's no guarantee. But I think this project, you're going to see some major, major action in the summer in June when they have uh, an upgrade happening. And hopefully by that time, we're kind of, we've already hit bottom is my hope. And we're, we're starting to come out of the, uh, out of the trenches. And then maybe we'll shoot back up to a dollar, dollar fifty at that time. But I really don't see too much happening between now and June. I just see kind of a prolonged bear market with some pumps and dumps, Bitcoin, you know, pumping up to 45, 50,000 and dumping right back down to 30,000. I'm not really expecting much. I have low expectations right now. And when you have low expectations, you're not let down. That's the beauty of low expectations. I don't expect much from you right now, Cardano. If you dump down to 30 cents tomorrow, I won't be mad. I'll still love you. If you pump up to a dollar tomorrow, I'll love you. You're like a special needs child to me right now. Whatever you do is great unless you don't pump in that bull market in 2024, then I'll disown you.